Hello my friends, welcome to Talk To Me Tuesday for Tuesday, May 26, 2020. This is Jennifer. Today is my dad's birthday, so I want to wish him a very happy birthday today. Also, as you can see, I am outside of the bright sunshine because I finished the graduation quilt. I got it all quilted and it is bound and it is labeled and I'm very proud of it. I'm very pleased with it. I could tell while I was working on it that my skill level has increased so much since the last time I did a t-shirt quilt and also my quilting uh, ability has, has, has definitely taken a leap since the last time I quilted a t-shirt quilt. So these are t-shirts that my son chose he said that he probably had a ton more, but he still wanted to wear them. He kind of picked and chose based on different things he's done over the years. There are concert t-shirts, anime t-shirts, club t-shirts, band t-shirts, various event t-shirts. This green square here, that's actually the back of the hoodie that he wore almost entirely through high school. He wore this hoodie so much that he went to school one day with a different jacket on and was counted absent in a couple of classes because of it. That's actually one of my favorite blocks because it's fleece, so when I quilted it, it's really puffy, it looks great. I had a great time with this. He's very pleased with it. I will show you guys the label. I actually designed the label. I, as you guys know, I upgraded a stitch artist. I designed the D20 outline, and then I hand drew all the little stars just using my embroidery software. The the text was already in the software or, or text that I had purchased from a couple different places that sell embroidery fonts. And then I purchased the tenor sax and the clarinet pattern from uh, an Etsy shop. And I will actually put a link because I don't remember the name of it off the top of my head, but I purchased those digitized uh, designs from Etsy. So that's all. Um, I'm going to do some good close-ups for you guys so you can see how I quilted it. And I can tell you that I am incredibly proud of my kid. It, not having graduation has been hard on all of us, but I feel like, you know, we'll get through it. We'll be strong. We're just trying to stay healthy and keep our family members safe. And I'm hoping that this gives him a little bit of closure because a graduation quilt is a thing that I've done for both of my kids, for both high school and college graduation. And I, I really just hope this gives him like just that little bit of closure. On to some close-ups. That's it for now. You guys have a wonderful week. You have a crafty week. Please stay well, stay healthy. Uh, check out the bonus patterns on Phantom and Stitches for Kingdom Hearts. And I will see you guys next week. Bye.